Hello everyone. Welcome to Rissa Roxit and Designed by Geeks. This charming little witch hat makes a wonderful Halloween decoration. You can make it small or large, just change the size in your cutting machine software. I've put the link where to buy this SVG file in the video description. Let's begin. You're going to cut out your pieces on your machine. There's going to be a hat brim, the hat band, the buckle, and there's going to be 16 of these little triangle pieces that make up the top of your hat. Uh, for this design, I would recommend not using glitter paper for the black parts. You need something that's going to hold the glue really well, and glitter paper does not like to be glued. For the 16 hat pieces, there is a score line down the middle. If you are a Cricut user, you're going to need to set and attach your score lines. If you're not sure how to do that, check out my video in the cards. It's going to show you how. You're going to start by folding each of the 16 triangles in half along the score lines. And then next, for each of the 16 triangles, you're going to place some glue at the top point and down at the bottom right edge. Don't use too much glue, just enough so it'll get the job done, but you don't want it like oozing out the side. So just be really conservative with your glue use. And then you're going to fold that in half and just make sure that the glue sticks. And you're going to repeat that for each of the 16 triangle pieces, placing glue at the top point and at the bottom right edge. Then you're going to wait for your glue to dry. Next, you're going to take one of your folded pieces and you're going to place some glue just right in the middle in a line. Again, just be conservative with your glue use. Don't use more than you need. And then you're going to stick another one of your pieces and put that right on top. Just line those up. Make sure that the folded edges are aligned. Just hold that down until the glue dries enough that it's not going to come apart. And then you're going to repeat that again. You're going to put another little line of glue right along the middle. You're going to stick another one of your pieces on top, getting those aligned. And you're just going to repeat that until you have all 16 pieces stacked and glued together. And when you're done gluing all 16 pieces together, you're going to end up with a little stack that looks like this. You have all the folded edges aligned and they're all stacked on top of each other. Now, the next step is really important, and that is to wait for your glue to dry completely. If your glue is even a little bit wet, if you try the next step, it might come apart. So just be patient and wait for your glue to dry. I'll join you in just a few minutes via the magic of video editing after the glue is dry. All right, I think that's dry now. So the next step is you're going to basically fan this out kind of like an accordion. And if you see, it's forming the round hat shape. And what you're going to do is you're going to place another line of glue in the middle, just like we were doing before. But this time we're gluing the top to the bottom of our little stack. So we're going to place our line of glue here. And then we're going to fan that out and bringing the top and the bottom together. And we want to hold that there until we're sure it's dry because right now it's going to want to close on us. It's going to um, pop off if we don't hold it until the glue is completely dry. The next step is we're going to take our buckle and our band and we're just going to slide the band and buckle together. So you're just going to put it on just like a regular belt buckle. You're just going to slide that through that little hole in the buckle and kind of bring it down to the middle. And for the buckle, if you want to use glitter, that's fine because you actually don't need any glue for the buckle. It's just going to attach by being strung through there. So that's a good uh, opportunity to use glitter if you're wanting to use glitter paper for that. Next, we are going to take the top of our hat and our hat brim, and we're going to glue that to our hat brim like so. And I recommend using a uh, hot glue or something similar since this isn't a flat edge. It's kind of, you know, a weird shape. It's going to hold better if you use hot glue or something like that. Just be careful that you don't burn yourself. You know, hot, hot glue can be. And just stick that onto the center of your hat brim.
And then last, we're going to take our hat band. We're going to wind it around the bottom of our hat. And you can put a little dot of glue just at the end so that you can stick the two ends together. And it's going to sit above the brim just a little bit. And you can just kind of keep your finger there until that glue dries to keep the band together. And here's what it looks like when it's all done. That's all it takes to make this cute little witch hat. Happy Halloween, and we will see you next time. Bye! We hope you liked this video. Please comment, like, and subscribe.